What does Disney have to do with science? Roller coasters. Who likes roller coasters? This vest is equipped with an accelerometer and a data recorder, so we can get a live readout of the G-forces you're feeling while you're on the ride. That's cool. That's physics. All right, let's get him in. Feeling comfortable? Kind of. Then you're not paying attention. <laughs> Special effects, what do you got for us today? They brought along a couple of special effects and uh, thought this would be a great opportunity to try them out in front of a uh, live audience. We're actually sending sound out at a frequency so high that you can't normally even hear it. By understanding the science of fluid dynamics, we're able to create magic quite literally out of thin air. In three, two, one. We use chemistry to make really pretty colors. Check this out. At Disney, we have used science to launch our fireworks with compressed air. Wow. Yeah. It's that. I was just explaining how computer science is actually changing the very way we go about designing our parks and attractions. That's true. Have you ever heard of artificial intelligence? Take a look at this. With computers, we can take the real life performance of a human actor and use that to drive our characters. Here to represent the world of life inside the Disney parks, she's senior conservation biologist from Disney's Animal Kingdom. Please help me welcome Dr. Ann Savage. Hey, it's great to be here. I see so many great looking future scientists out there. Let me show you a cool tracking device. Can you make a sound like an elephant? Ooh. We're gonna put this collar on you. The transmitter will send a signal up to the satellite and we can get those location points. This thing sends a signal to a satellite in outer space? Absolutely. Each of us Imagineers carries a notebook just like this one. And when you guys leave the theater today, you're gonna get your very own Imagineers notebook. Yep. 